Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Church at Home for Pre-K. Now, some of you may be asking, Miss Rachel, why do you have those silly orange dots all over your face? Well, that's because, boys and girls, today we're going to read a story from the Bible. And when we read our Bible, we're going to read about a man named Naaman who has painful sores all over his body. But God heals Naaman. That's right. God takes away all of Naaman's painful sores. Do you know, boys and girls, that God is all powerful? That means that God has power over our bodies when we're sick. God can heal you from sickness. Now today, boys and girls, we're going to read from the Bible. The Bible is the word of God. That means that when we open the Bible and we read the words in the Bible, we're reading God's words. It's God's message to us. This Bible story is called God Heals Naaman. Naaman was an important army commander. But he had leprosy. He had painful sores all over his body. A servant girl in his house told Naaman's wife, Elisha can ask God to help Naaman. When Elisha heard that Naaman wanted to be made well, he sent a message, have Naaman come to me. So Naaman went to Elisha's house. Elisha's servant told Naaman, Elisha says to wash in the Jordan River seven times, then he may be made well. At first, Naaman was angry. Washing in the river sounded silly. He started to walk away. Now, boys and girls, do you think the river is going to heal Naaman? No, God is going to heal Naaman. But Naaman's servant said, if you had to pay money or do something hard, you would do it. Why not obey? What does he have to lose, right? So Naaman walked to the river. He ducked under the water seven times. Naaman came up and his sores were gone. Naaman said, the God of Israel has made me well. He is the one true God. Today, boys and girls, I want you to know that with God, all things are possible. That means that God can do anything. God can even heal Naaman with sores all over his body. And God cares about you when you're sick too. But I want you to know that God has power over sickness. God can heal any sickness. Thank you, boys and girls, for joining me. And I hope to see you next week for Church on for Pre-K. Have a good day.